potential $2,000 stimulus for Social Security, disability, and veteran recipients. In the midst of the current economic climate, marked by high inflation and rising costs of living, the federal government is exploring various avenues to provide much-needed financial relief to some of the most vulnerable segments of the population. Among the proposals under consideration is a potential stimulus payment of up to $2,200 for individuals receiving Social Security benefits, including Social Security Insurance, SSI, and Social Security Disability Insurance, SSDI, as well as veterans. The rationale behind this potential stimulus is rooted in the recognition that those relying on fixed government incomes, such as Social Security and disability benefits, are disproportionately impacted by the surge in inflation. As the prices of essential goods and services continue to rise, the purchasing power of these fixed payments has diminished, leaving many seniors, disabled individuals, and veterans struggling to make ends meet. The proposed $2,200 stimulus would be a multi-pronged effort drawing from both the current administration's plans and the previous administration's initiatives. The first component is a $2,200 stimulus check that the current administration has been exploring based on economic calculations and assessments of the needs of these vulnerable populations. The second component is a potential $2,000 check that was previously proposed by the Trump administration but has not yet been fully implemented. The $2,200 stimulus, if approved, would be deposited directly into the bank accounts of eligible recipients, which include SSI and SSDI beneficiaries, as well as veterans. The rationale behind this amount is to provide a meaningful cushion against the rising costs of living, helping to bridge the gap between fixed incomes and the increased expenses faced by these individuals. The potential $2,000 stimulus, on the other hand, was initially proposed by the previous administration as a means of providing additional financial support to SSI and SSDI recipients. While the details and implementation of this proposal are still being finalized, the prospect of this additional payment has generated significant interest and anticipation among the target population. Taken together, the combined $4,200 in potential stimulus funds would represent a substantial infusion of support for those relying on Social Security, disability, and veteran benefits. The timeliness of these payments is crucial, as the impact of high inflation has been particularly acute for these individuals, who often have limited financial flexibility and resources to absorb the rising costs. It is important to note that while the stimulus payments are generally non-taxable and should not affect other government benefits, recipients are encouraged to consult with financial professionals to understand the full implications for their specific situation. This is particularly important given the potential interaction between the stimulus and other programs, as well as the potential tax implications. To ensure the smooth and secure delivery of these funds, recipients are advised to verify their bank account information with the Social Security Administration or the relevant government agencies. This step is crucial to avoid any delays or complications in the processing of the electronic deposits, which are expected to be faster than mailed checks. Furthermore, it is crucial for recipients to be vigilant against potential scams and unsolicited communications related to these stimulus payments. Individuals should only rely on information from official government sources and verified channels to ensure the integrity of the process and protect themselves from fraudulent activities. Local community organizations and social service providers can also play a vital role in supporting recipients throughout this process. These organizations can offer guidance, resources, and assistance in navigating the logistics of the stimulus program, as well as provide valuable insights into how to best utilize the funds to address individual financial needs and priorities. The potential $4,200 stimulus for Social Security, Disability, and Veteran recipients represents a significant effort by the government to provide much-needed relief to some of the most vulnerable members of our society. As inflation continues to erode the purchasing power of fixed incomes, this multifaceted stimulus program aims to offer a vital lifeline to those who rely on these essential government benefits. By staying informed, verifying information, and leveraging community resources, eligible recipients can maximize the impact of this financial support and weather the current economic challenges with greater resilience. The importance of timely delivery and accessibility
The timely delivery of these stimulus payments is of paramount importance as the inflationary pressures on the budgets of Social Security, disability, and veteran recipients have been relentless, with the cost of essential goods and services, such as food, housing, and health care, continuing to rise at a rapid pace, the need for this financial assistance has become increasingly urgent. To ensure the most efficient and accessible distribution of the funds, the government is exploring various delivery methods with a focus on electronic deposits. This approach is expected to result in faster processing times compared to traditional mailed checks, which can often be subject to delays and logistical challenges. By prioritizing electronic transfers, the government aims to put the money into the hands of eligible recipients as quickly as possible, allowing them to immediately receive pressing financial needs. This is particularly crucial for those living on fixed incomes who may have limited financial flexibility to absorb the impact of the crisis. At the same time, the government recognizes that not all recipients may have easy access to electronic banking or may prefer traditional payment methods. To ensure inclusivity and accessibility, the stimulus program will also accommodate recipients who opt to receive their payments via mailed checks, protecting against scams and fraudulent activity. Given the significant amount of money involved and the vulnerability of the target population, the government is also acutely aware of the potential for scams and fraudulent activity surrounding the stimulus payments. To safeguard recipients, Extensive measures are being put in place to ensure the integrity of the program and protect individuals from predatory actors. One of the key strategies is to encourage recipients to verify their information and payment details directly with the relevant government agencies, such as the Social Security Administration or the Department of Veterans Affairs. This step is crucial to prevent the exploitation of unsuspecting individuals by criminals posing as government officials or representatives. Additionally, the government is launching a comprehensive public awareness campaign to educate recipients on the legitimate channels for accessing information and receiving their payments. This includes providing clear guidance on how to identify and report any suspicious activities or unsolicited communications related to the stimulus program. By empowering recipients with the knowledge and tools to navigate the process safely, the government aims to minimize the risk of fraud and ensure that the stimulus funds reach the intended beneficiaries without interference from malicious actors. Navigating tax implications and benefit interactions. While the stimulus payments are generally considered non-taxable, it is essential for recipients to understand the potential tax implications and how the funds may interact with their existing government benefits and financial situations. The government acknowledges that the stimulus payments could have varying effects on individual tax liabilities and eligibility for other programs such as Medicaid, Supplemental Nutrition Assistance Program, SNAP, or Housing Assistance. 